cadets and we were hiking through the bush and one of the issues with hiking as an army cadet was that the boots that we got used to give us blisters, okay? And what would happen is the only way to fix that at the time you'd have the blister is to just whip the boot off, put a band-aid on, put the boot back on and then keep going. Remember from the very start, just deal with it? That was the solution, right? And that's what we got told. The solution is put a band-aid on, just away you go. One of the stories in there is about, you know, it's 10 o'clock in the morning, you've had your morning bit, feeling a bit flat, so you go down and visit the barista downstairs, have your little uh, special uh, caffeine, little whip up, and then that just keeps you going for the next little bit, right? Then at lunchtime, you have a little bit of stuff and you want to need to do, and then you need a bit of sugar to keep kick you on in the afternoon, and all of a sudden you're just relying on all these little short, sharp fixes, but ultimately it's not looking at, well, why am I here in the first place, okay? I, I was there, I was like going, all right, I'm a little bit flat, I'll look back now, I need a little bit of coffee, or I didn't drink coffee back then, so I had a Red Bull, or I'll do something else, or I eat some sugar, you know, lots, lots of chocolate, you see a lot of chocolate when I was in my 20s, and then it all came full circle to me crashing out, and we all know where that was, right? So it's all about looking higher level, taking a step back, what is causing me to get this blister, 